It has been a chock a week at Rangers and it began with a trio of interviews early on Monday morning. Wes Fodringham and Graham Murty previewed the midweek game while Danny Wilson will be your feature player in the Motherwell Matchday programme. The game falls on the defender's 26th birthday. On Tuesday, the focus was on the trip to Easter Road. Josh Winder started off a good week by chatting to the media before his current manager followed him. The oldest living Ranger was also in town as 94-year-old Bobby Brown met the current Rangers roster to promote his new book. The development squad played in the afternoon in a hastily arranged game. A hat-trick from Ryan Hardy and girls from Cammy Palmer and Matty Shields defeated St Mirren 5-4. The Saints had a strong side out containing a large amount of first-team players. Before the team took on Hibs on Wednesday, the sports minister paid a special visit to the Rangers Charity Foundation's new Get Ready for Sport programme at Craigton Primary School in Govan. And then all roads led to Edinburgh as the Light Blues grabbed a win in the capital. Rangers went one down, but two quick goals from Windass and Alfredo Morelis gave Murty side control as they held on for three points and stayed in second. The players enjoyed a rest day on Thursday, but the Charity Foundation was still busy, entertaining at Ibrox. They held their annual Christmas lunch for 70 older people from local community groups. The team got back to work on Friday morning as they got their shooting boots on at an icy Ockenhowie. Then after a team Christmas lunch, Murty and Danny Wilson previewed Saturday's game against St Johnston. Hello. And Carlos Peña picked up his goal of the month gong for his goal against Aberdeen. Jason Holt was on hand to recreate the strike with a fan at the training ground. As ever, you can watch this weekend's game live on Rangers TV. Current Academy coach Peter Lovenkrantz is on COCOMS.